Hello and welcome back to close to the sun. Let's do that again. Thank you. Hallucinating. My big sister is here. We'll go to the theater and get this thing in the book. Together, they will be everything. <laughs> <laughs> Don't take such deep breaths when you are in the. Everything right next to you. Solving place. equations in seconds that have kept less a man at bay for weeks. You could practically hear his mind tick, Manny. You could hear it like a force of nature. Aubrey. And I tell you what. Aubrey. Hang, hang on. Aubrey. Rosie, you're back. Great. I was just telling Benny here. The theater, Aubrey. How do I get to it? You said there was an elevator? Of course. It's right up ahead. Bringing it to you now. What do you need to do there, anyway? I need to find a notebook. Rose, I cannot fathom the sorrow you feel. And you have my sincerest sympathies. But I've saved your life a handful of times already. I think I've earned to know what this is about. You're right, Aubrey. I'm sorry. I'm looking for a notebook that my sister hid somewhere in the theater. It contained her new research, and I promised her I'd guard it. The entire ship recognized her brilliance. The included. And now she's gone. The elevator is here, Rose. I am pleased to announce that thanks to your hard work and dedication, we are now back on schedule. I know it has been a rough month, but the latest core inspection showed all active systems to be performing nominally and contamination within acceptable limits. I know you all are as excited as me to get this beast up and running, but we still have a bunch of diagnostics to run before we can truly put her to the test. Until then, I've set aside a small piece of our budget for an open bar night this coming to Thursday. Just show a physics department badge at your favorite bar and you'll have free drinks until midnight. Enjoy yourselves, you've earned it. But don't overdo it. I still expect you up and ready Friday morning. We've got a lot to work, of work still to do, but your diligence is paying off. Thank you, and have fun. Sorry, I cannot see a thing. It's so damn dark. The drama of the Anises. That was a quick chapter, I must admit. Any idea where this notebook might be hidden? It's a fairly large theater, you know. Afraid not. But how big can it be, really? Um. You saw the shit. Oh. That's just the lobby. Wait until you see the auditorium. I leave you to search while I resolve some issues with the weather tech devices. I'll uh, check in with you later, all right? Sure. This might take a while. Yeah, a little while. I am terribly sorry the tower upgrades demanded my attention far longer than I anticipated. I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all, sir. I'm still learning how to best get around here on the Heliums. So many floors, so much to see. Quite so, but I have saved the best for last. 
the Helios Grand Theater. Shall we? By all means. By all means. By all means. This, Miss Archers, is the Helios Grand Theater. Wow. I'm glad you like it. We have a wonderful lineup of performances this year. And if you look closely, up there, that is your private balcony, from where you'll be able to watch them. The balcony used to be my own, but I insist you take it as a welcome aboard gift and as a token of my appreciation for your research. What? I don't... I don't... I don't know what to say, sir. Oh, it is the least I can do, and please, call me Nicole. It's not mine, not anymore. And people will always gossip. It interests me little. Come now, let me show you the view. Of course! A private balcony? Would you hide your research there, Ada? Such an honor to perform aboard the Helios. Thank you, Ludovica. Always wanted to see her perform. Of course, it will be closed. Okay. For some reason, it did not occur to me that she will just fall as it is, because, okay. Apparently, we're not meant to jump that. I think I saw some flicker. Yep. How come? From there, it was merely a matter of building. But enough about me. What about you, Ada? What about your family? You had a sister, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, Rose. Rose Archer. And if you think I'm stubborn, wait till you meet my sister. What does she do? She's a journalist. Is that so? Is she any good? The best. Second Tuesday of September. Dear Diary. Today Michael mixed up our beer bottles and drank from mine. I told him about the mistake and we laughed about it. If he does it again, I'll fucking stomp him on his throat until his wine pipe is as clogged as the Helios toilets. He's a good guy though. And he smells nice. Like lavender and fish. Ah, here we are. I do hope it will provide you with much joy while aboard the Helios. It's wonderful. I really cannot thank you enough. Nonsense, my dear. Just continue to pursue your theories. That will be gratitude plenty. I, I, I truly believe you are onto something revolutionary, Ada. It's just missing that final spark. I hope the Helios will provide the resources required for us to find it. Because when we do, we will have changed the world forever. To changing the world. To changing the world. Into what exactly? Not here. Not here. 
Come on. There's, there's, there's a secret room in my room. You find it while I make my way through another laboratory department. I'll give you a clue. It's center stage. Th that's it. You're just going to leave me to figure this out on my own? Have fun. Okay, so... Remember, always when you are busy, someone will come back, come, and have something important for you. Always. Okay, it couldn't be more obvious. from a bus I still don't get these visions of Ada or how the radio played our conversation from the past but it's like she's still here leading me onwards it's you you are neither back then in the future you are somewhere in between That's why you see the, these monsters. That's why you see these ghosts. All right, center stage. How do I get up there? Gratitude. If Fabrier. Okay, I think I see it. The trail of bodies will lead us. And this would I mean they've been decaying for some time already. That the flies are feasting on their bodies. If I was super secret research, who would I hide? Not so super secret. <laughs> I saw that heart. Bar and that mouse button just simply would work. Why? I have to keep holding. Shit! 
Where did he go? You really want to know? I don't see a thing. Wait, right here. And I have no idea where I have to press something for her to react properly and where I can just walk towards. Because here I have to press. why I'm usually not so uh, not so scared of those games. Oh you see again it's gone. And it appeared after he caught us. Okay we'll go a different way. You see, <laughs> she just refused. Make your peace. Okay. Our collective suffering ends today. I think he wasn't so lucky. In. I could have used you like five minutes ago. You found the notebook, didn't you? I bet you did! Right? Right? Yes, Aubrey. I got the notebook. And then I ran into Ludwig. Oh no. Are you okay? I'm fine, Aubrey. And thankfully, Ludwig took a face full of fire, so that's one problem less. News after another. What's next? The bad news? I'm lost. I, I think there's an elevator here, but I can't really tell. It's too dark. Aha! Not a problem. Pay attention to the lights around you and let me know when they start blinking. All right? Sure. Any 
anything yet? No, nothing. Wait! Now! Aubrey, now! Oh, that's deck 66. Next order of business, getting you that elevator. Fantastic, Aubrey. Thank you again for everything. I'm coming to make good of my promise. You have no idea how good that sounds. Uh, wait, let me get the doors. Oh, god damn it. What's wrong? There's... Ugh, gross. There's the body of a man crucified against the elevator wall. Is there a different elevator you can send up? I'd rather not. It's... it's the only one. It's the only one, Rose. I hate this place. I hate this place so much. <sighs> one leaf in. One thorn out. Thanks for doing this, Rose. Yeah. At least we have Ludwig out of the way. After he managed to kill us three times. Okay, and I think that's gonna be it for today. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!